Uh, hello and welcome to the test of Sony STR DH520 multi channel audio video receiver. Uh, in this test, I'm going to show you how to uh, set up uh, the speaker layout and how to do aut automatic calibration of the speakers. Uh, so, what you need to do first is uh, use the remote and go to amp menu. So, we are now here, and then you have to se select the, the uh, find the speaker up and down, find the speaker menu and go into that and select the pattern. So, uh, basically in this setup I have uh, 5.1 speakers, uh, meaning that I have subwoofer, uh, two front uh, uh, stereo speakers, uh, two back uh, speakers and one central speaker in the front. So, uh, okay, the menu has exited automatically. So I go into the pattern and I select according to the table in this guidebook, I select uh, the appropriate uh, setup, and uh, you can see here on the left uh, what each of the setup means. I mean, this has only two, uh, two speakers on the left and two on the right, and subwoofer here. So uh, I will select. Uh, I since I have this is my this is my layout. So I have uh, two speakers on the left, two speakers on the right, plus a central speaker. And I'm using, uh, by the way, uh, Acoustimas Bose uh, 5.1 speakers. So after uh, we have uh, changed the pattern of our speakers, now we can go and do the calibration. First, we need to connect the microphone uh, from behind the, the, the speakers and position the microphone somewhere in the room, uh, preferably in the position where you will be sitting at. Then uh, we have to go to the, uh, again, to the amp menu, so I, I press the amp button, and I I need to go to uh, a can can be uh, it's written. So uh, this means auto calibration, and I go into into this uh, menu sub menu, and then uh, I can select here uh, maybe uh, types of calibration, and I will use in this case standard calibration. And uh, at this point, the only thing I have to do is press uh, the start button. So here, and the calibration will start. It's counting down from 5 to 1 and then it will start. And this is basically it. I mean, after the, uh, the receiver displays 7 exit, you can, you can uh, go and retry. You can select this by going up and down uh, in the menu. Retry, uh, you can check the warnings uh, by this, in, and it says no warnings. Uh, basically, what, what warning means uh, is that uh, when you select some pattern, as we did previously, then it will um, test speakers of that pattern and if it, does, if it uh, detects that some of the speaker isn't working then it will uh, say that under warnings uh, but we have no warnings here so that's that's fine so we, we can go uh, uh, okay uh, and we go, go back to save and exit and just select this option and everything is done now so speakers have been calibrated um, it's difficult to test really if the, the calibration has done anything but uh, Hopefully, uh, something uh, will come out of it. So let's switch back to tuner and listen to some music. And this is the end of this test.